because Ortiz had his hands down. Sure. Look at the official dating back to that 2007 fight against Ricky Hatton that you mentioned. So, uh, But let's not forget, he knocked out a guy who's never been in a boxing ring before. I mean, he's supposed to knock him out. Teddy, let me stop for a second. Was Floyd good tonight? He, he won the fight. Was Floyd Mayweather good tonight? He was what he had to be. His character, his championship character, and his big, big, big advantage of experience and belief in himself in this kind of format allowed him to dominate the guy in a way that he usually doesn't dominate guys. He was he was no. able to to pull that ace out of the out of the deck I, when he had to. I very 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 respectfully disagree with, the, with this expert right here. Floyd was not great tonight. He wasn't sharp tonight. And the reason why I say that wasn't... I didn't say he was great. I know that. I know that. But you're saying he was... He's saying he was what no, he his championship but, uh, but, but let me explain. quality allowed him to do what he well, did. Well, let me explain what I mean. It wasn't just that Floyd was missing. He was missing against a guy who had his arms down, who didn't have a lot of head movement, who didn't have the greatest defense in the world. Now, if Connor was moving, had a lot of head and body movement, and he was shifting and what have you, and because of that, he was difficult to hit... I would sit up there and say, okay, that was what it was. But the problem is that Connor was standing there, relatively stationary. Arms were down, and when he put his arm out, he wasn't even putting the jab out. He was just going like this. And by the way, to throw a jab, you got to pull it. You know this better than me. You got to pull your arm back in and throw the jab. So I'm looking at all of these things, and your inability to still hit him with the degree of consistency he and accuracy. Fought, I, I'm accustomed to seeing here's what happened. McGregor, I believe what I'm saying is McGregor forced... He forced the gourmet chef to be a fast order cook. That's what he did. He, he forced the gourmet chef to that be a guy. Make, but doesn't that make it fast food? I mean, are you yeah, now, it doesn't does. that make it fast food? That's exactly what it does. He made, I mean, that's what I'm saying. He made I mean, him go it, in it, there. Listen. And he made him flip cheeseburgers. Well, listen, he made him there we go. He made him do something. Whoa, 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 whoa,